David F. Welcome back to carburetorsandmore.com, 832-221-4007. All right, let's see what we diagnose. We've got gas in it. We've got the pump on. I'm going to make a statement. I might get myself in trouble. But I was the one that took it out of the box. That tube right there was jammed full of something. I had to drill it out. I don't know if it was dirt or cardboard or what. But anyway, I just tell it like I see them. I don't work on them. I just unbox them and bring them out here. Right now I'm testing. It starts right up. Describing. You rev it up, you let it come back to idle, and it dies. It looks like okay. Go ahead and see how far these are. in a big old mouthful of dirt. Like I told you, that pipe right there was full of dirt. I had to drill it out. So I don't know if that comes from your gas line or you were dragging it along the ground from insulation. But I'll tell you right now, this side of the carburetor is not working. It, it's almost shut right off. And... Half, three quarters, one. Okay, there, there, right there is two turns and it won't run. You've got a restriction on this side. So, whenever you rev it up and it goes back to the idle, I don't know about the whoosh sound that you make, except that would be the sound it would make trying to, trying to engage the back barrel. Yeah, you, you, you sucked up a ton of dirt in this thing. Now, the more it runs, the more that dirt gets circulated. Uh, it, what's going to happen if I accelerate it? It'll backfire and blow off that expensive light right there. So I'm not going to do it. Okay. 
We're going to tear it apart. We're going to clean it out for free the first time. That's it. The next time you will pay. So that cardboard is definitely full of dirt. We just compared all the uh, previous pre, videos. Free teardown video and the complete video. And you're exactly right. This is going to have to go in there and get, get fixed. Dirt, dirt City.